It was such a beautiful article. And I think it was, well, somebody told me that it was, uh, it got more response than any article in the New York Times in years. And I can understand why. It was just a beautiful, beautiful story about these uh, former American soldiers who were from the, hill, the hills and in, in, uh, just outside of Laos and now are in the jungles in, of Vientiane uh, running from the now communist uh, Laotian government soldiers and police who are trying to track them down because they were our friends back in those days. And their numbers are probably close to 5,000. Fuller caught up with a couple of hundred of them who had never seen a Westerner since 1975 since we left. They, they and their kids and now their grandkids and beautiful looking folks. They, they, they're just mountain people. They live on, on bamboo shoots and wild yams and little animals that they can find and run from place to place to avoid being captured by or killed by the Laotians. So it's a sad, beautiful story. At the end of the story, one of the guys, the sweetest damn thing, I, he said, um, he said, I know, I know when you go home, I know when you go home you're going to try to help us. But if you can't, but if you can't, don't feel sad. So it's like, whoa. Fine. 